Hi and welcome to the walkthrough of the A3 Halloween poster. I'd like to show you what this thing is made of and how to edit it. To start off let's see what it consists of. It has the background, some bats, a border, and then it has the main image and two hands with some text in it. The title and some extras. The whole thing is made out of vector and to edit it all you have to do is simply select the text tool which is here select your um, desired font to change change it to something that you like Some layers include some extra elements, for example this one has leaks. Um, these leaks you will be able to align uh, according to your specific image, for example like this. And the same could be done with the chains, by going and taking the left one, moving it across slightly, taking the right one, and doing the same. All of the text layers are completely editable, so to change something all you gotta click somewhere and type something in. The text in the hand is clipped by a vector mask, which allows you certain space, and if you go over it that's also not a problem, because all you have to do is select it, and expand to see the rest of it. As I mentioned before, everything is in vector. However, some of these vectors are in smart objects. For example, the background. If we open it, we can see we've got a vector background. Mm, for example, also the, the main graphic, however, was made in Illustrator. Here is Illustrator. Here is the wireframe. Gotta zoom in. I've included some presets. Uh, the hands have one line, two lines three lines as you've seen before, and an alternative text. Due to the white border, it is very easy to adjust your bleed. All you have to do is go to image, canvas size, make it relative, and adjust your bleed size. And just you can also increase the border a bit. make it look a little different. And that's all there is to it. From now on, your creativity steals the show. Enjoy it, and uh, if you do like it, don't forget to rate 5 stars. Thanks.